Hi friends, how are you doing? <laughs> if you're watching, if you watched yesterday's video, you know at what point in my day I switched you guys. I'm gonna do two videos today to get caught up on life and editing and being able to actually enjoy summertime. I'm going to um, do some extra videos so that I'm not constantly having to sit and edit, all that kind of stuff. So, today's video, ignore the mess, uh, somewhat of a mess, actually there's not much in here. Um, today's video, we're going to do some decluttering. Let me show you the different areas that we're going to declutter and get cleaned up. We are going to ignore, this is a real video, this is like my real life. Dishes still have not been loaded because a child is not awake yet. Um, we are going to organize this monstrosity, this cupboard here. Um, we are going to get more flour today at Costco. We're, so we're going to organize this. Only like this stuff needs to get like brought down and organized. But then that shelf is like awful. This one is pretty bad. We also need to organize this little section. I actually should like look on Amazon. It's Amazon Prime Day tomorrow. Hmm, maybe I shall look for some new little spice jars. This is kind of my old school method. Maybe I will do that. Maybe we will do that. We are also going to do a mild cleanup. I don't know. This mild clean out of this drawer. This is the junk drawer, but it's looking pretty good. I could take out a little bit of the junk, put things where they belong, like, you know, combs. But, so we're gonna do that drawer. And just because we're doing two cupboards, we're gonna do two drawers. We're gonna do this drawer right here. I know it doesn't look terrible, but I just have been chucking stuff in here. I might go and get some of those little tubs at Target that I have in my other drawers, but I don't know if they're gonna fit. So I might go grab one from my makeup table because I just have like an extra need of like another spot to put stuff. Or maybe I don't. Maybe I need to just organize and get rid of a bunch of junk and have a better spot for it. So this is the other drawer that I need to organize. I even wrote it on my list in my decluttering era. <laughs> I thought that would be a fun way to um, label the video today, but I made a list of all the things that I want to get cleaned out. But I think if I start in my office, I'm going to want to turn on a show. And that's not where I can start. <laughs> if I'm doing that, I can guarantee you I will get sucked into said show and I won't be as productive. So we're going to start here in the kitchen. Um, yeah, we're going to start here in the kitchen. I couldn't help myself. I'm looking at spice jars. I'm actually seeing if anything will get delivered today. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything. Uh, these are the ones I want. Um, everything, everything says that they can come tomorrow, but maybe that's okay. Maybe that's okay. Um, or do I wait until tomorrow and see if there's a prime deal? Uh, I don't know. It's a toss-up. Okay, it literally says it's going to go cheaper in 20 hours. So I need to be patient. I could get 20% or 10% off right now. But I'm betting that there's going to be a better sale. So I'm going to hold off. That's just, just one I clicked into because it said right here, it said upcoming deal. These ones didn't say that. Oh, there's one. This is the kind I want. I want like the bamboo lid, the airtight seal on the bamboo lid. Oh, I have to be patient. But maybe what I'm going to do, okay, maybe what I'm going to do is count how many spices I actually need. Like how many jars I actually need. Um, so that'll be good. I'll get that done. I'm going to take all of this out and then tomorrow, bright and early, I'm going to check the prime deals and we'll order our spice jars so I can get a good deal on that. So we'll do that really quick and then we'll tackle this guy. We'll get the kitchen part done and then we'll do this one. So one, two, and then three. So this guy here, we're going to just kind of make space. This is clean. We are just going to start taking everything out of the cupboard. 
Look at my cute little tiki jar. I wish I could go get another one, but the Dole store is burned down. It's so sad. Maybe a next trip I'm gonna have to find another store that has those little tiki cups because they're really cute. Okay, I digress. This cookbook here, all, I'm not doing anything with any of this or any of the decor stuff up here. This cookbook here keeps everything lined up, hopefully, and that jar, but I'm worried if I take this little box out, it will fall down, but I'm pretty sure we can throw away, yeah, we can throw away all this stuff. Maybe, maybe we can declutter some of these. I don't tend to use these little decorations as often anymore. I don't know, but we're gonna, we're just gonna start here. We got a whole bunch of garbage there. So we're gonna line up our spice jars. See some of them I haven't even like put the spice in. I don't even know. Oh, baking soda. Oh, I hid that donut up here yesterday. I need to get that in the fridge. I literally put it in there yesterday. <laughs> Kids don't look for things in the spice section. Get that kind of cold again because the chocolate's melting. Mom hack, hide it in broccoli bags in the freezer. And I can only say this because that one over there has her headphones on and can't hear a thing I'm saying. She might look at me right now and wonder what I'm saying, but she literally can't hear a thing. <laughs> She's not even flinching. She's not paying attention to me, so I can say anything. All right. We're going to take... See, I, I went to using these. This is taco seasoning, but I don't have them labeled, so... All right, you don't want to watch me take every single one of these out. So I'm just going to take these all down and then we'll get it all cleaned out. Okay, all the spices are out. We have 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 20, 20, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 in those, those jars. But then we have six of these guys, onion powder that isn't in one, and then I just have the regular salt and pepper shakers that go on the counter. Uh, the table. The pepper goes on the table. So, 24, but some of these are empty, or, yeah, they're just empty. So, I'm going to go through them all, see what ones are maybe a duplicate, like onions versus minced onions. That's not a duplicate. So, I'm just going to kind of glance through them and see what we've got. Alright, so what I've done, and how I want to organize it going forward is like put them into categories when I so when I look for like garlic powder onion powder ginger I want to look for the yellows um, it's just gonna be easier to see it that way so like all of these guys are gonna be by each other so I've got those ones categorized cinnamon nutmeg pumpkin spice those are all kind of a category and um, then I've got like chili powder crushed peppers curry powder Allspice, allspice, that's more of a, I don't know, yeah, that's a, like, more of a sweet one. S see, these ones are kind of, like, spicy ones. Cloves, cloves, that's more like that guy. And then red pepper, these are kind of hotter ones. Then I'm going to put, like, the taco seasoning here as well. We can put the cinnamon by these guys. Then we'll have our white powders, cream of tartar, and baking soda. But baking soda, I don't know why they have, this has gone bad then, because baking soda has to go in the fridge. I don't know. I have to ask Jason. I don't know why he crossed off baking powder and then why he put it in the fridge or didn't put it in the fridge. So I'm betting this whole thing is bad because if it's truly baking soda, it shouldn't be in the, in the cupboard. And then Lowry's will go with this guy. And then I've got all my greens. Thyme, this, oh, that's pepper. We'll do that one here by the kind of the spicy ones. Thyme, rosemary, basil, bay leaves, Italian. I go through this a lot. And then oregano. So these are all my greens. So I like that. I like the idea of kind of separating them and putting them into categories. Now I have to be patient and wait for um, tomorrow to order a new set. But I'm betting I'm going to save quite a bit of money. So that's worth it to me. For now, we're going to take this guy out. I don't think it's going to fit whatever jars I end up getting. So I am going to take it out, but I'm not going to get rid of it. 
but I'm also not going to take the time to clean it right now unless I, I really need to. Unless I need to utilize this back in the cupboard, I'm not going to do that. But I'm going to clean this part out. I'm not going to move that jar because I think part of that is holding the rest of this up. We're going to wipe this out and then I'm just going to put the jars back in the cupboard, cupboard just to have the mess gone. You know how I like to keep things real. I just went to grab these and someone put them in the cupboard upside down. So now all the liquid is in there and then you also start to then see the mess. So we're gonna clean this out really quick. There's plenty of cleaner on the ground. So I'm gonna just wipe it. Ugh. This is, this is the Pandora. This is what starts to happen when you do little projects like this and why I needed it to be its own video. Okay, now I gotta get down. <laughs> now I gotta get down there and wipe it all out. Pull the trash cans out, pull the cleaning bucket out. I hate doing this, but it'll be done fast. All right, we aren't gonna show too closely. I tried to wipe this wall down, but there's still, I'm not gonna waste the time. <laughs> and that's not, this is recycle. That's garbage, so. Jason just got home. We're gonna keep going. That is garbage, cleaning, and cleaning. We're not gonna do anything else. We're just gonna put that stuff away. And now we're gonna wipe this down, which is where I started out. Okay, that cupboard is all cleaned out. We're just gonna put all of these back in. Kinda of keep them in their little order. And we'll worry about them later on. Okay, this is the last one going in, but I gotta ask Jason about this. So I don't even, I don't think I'm gonna put it back in the cupboard. But I've got these guys in here. So it is organized. It can wait for my package to arrive when I order it um, and I can still access it. But I'm not really doing any cooking these days just cause it's hot and I'm trying not to turn on the stove. So that is done. I do have these extra jars. I'm just gonna throw out that, well, maybe I'll keep the sea salt and get some more. It's like that pink Himalayan salt. But I've got these two jars. Likely just throw those away. That's all garbage right there. Moving on, got these guys. And again, we just take everything out and then we put it all back in. One shelf empty. Here they are the components of that shelf. I had three packets of onion soup mix opened. And funny enough, new medication I'm on, that doesn't taste so good anymore, which is a good thing because I loved French onion dip and chips. So just not eating that as much. I also have these when I, st way back when I started my little weight loss journey, I got these two to try different recipes. I don't like them, so I'm going to donate them. <laughs> so now for the second shelf, let's see how many oils we have. I've got a little start. Let's see if we have any duplicates opened up. But I know that Ashley doesn't know that this is an actual like, um, even though it's like olive oil, she could have used this on our uh, brownies for the family party. The brownies did not in fact come out of the pan. <laughs> she didn't know that, that she could spray with that, but now I know I need to get like another kind of spray that she can use for actual baking, not just for like cooking. Another one of my health kick items. These are expensive. These are expensive. I might keep this. I don't even know how to say that. But I'm just not going to use these. Husk powder. I don't even know. I, I'm not going to try that. I have two salts open. This one is brand new. So I can just dump this little guy into that. We have a cute little maple syrup. But I don't know how long it's been back there. So I'm going to throw that away. I'm going to make a nice little section of like extracts. I don't even think I have almond extract. So I'm going to get some of that. I should actually get out a list. Hang on. Okay, started a little list right by my other target list. So we'll get those today. Also have two mystery jars. I'm hoping they're like cocoa powder. I'm hoping it that's what it is, like hot cocoa powder. But I don't know. I don't know what they are. Um, also, don't, I'm assuming that's sugar. These are popcorn flavorings. I just don't use them. So we're going to donate those some Himalayan pink salt. You just, it's like one of those crusher ones. Um, I'm just not gonna use this stuff. So I'm gonna donate that. Those oils can be combined. There's two of those. Cinnamon goes over here. 
We're gonna put all these guys, along with the baking powder, we're gonna put all that with the baking stuff, or like the spices. There is some ranch. I'm gonna throw this one away, because I thought I had an actual ranch. Like a jar of ranch. Where'd that go? All right, got these all cleaned off. Jace, I need the step stool. I need the step stool to reach up. <sighs> I don't know, it's up there somewhere. Can't reach that shelf up here. But I think I'm gonna do the spices up here and not, and then put the flour sugar up here. Cause we use these way more often. So I'm gonna combine these guys, figure out what ones are gonna go on these shelves. Probably still put like powder, I don't know. Maybe I'll just make that one just like the heavier stuff. This one likes to say all the time she's four inches taller than me. She has longer arms than me. So I'm, I'm making her, I don't wanna wait for Jace. Not too bad. No. Maybe one more swipe at it and that'll call good. Cause I'm just gonna put buckets on that shelf. That? It's pepper, that's okay. Okay, that shelf is done. And now I can figure out what to put on. This is like salt and this cocoa powder on this one. All right, I got a little bit distracted because I made a funny joke on my family's group, group message and only one of my sisters thought it was appropriate <laughs> and funny. <laughs> it's very actually not appropriate, but I got a little distracted. Um, and I just kind of kept cleaning. I went through my little bucket up there, I'll show you. Um, emptied out a bunch of garbage. I actually should have put these, all of these like baking supplies um, into that bucket. I'll do that here right now. And then I think I'm gonna show you the end result. And hopefully everyone can handle where I have put everything. I thought I had poured baking soda down the sink. So I thought I would test it with some vinegar. And it looks like it really is. Baking soda. Well, it's not like doing anything to the sink. Okay, this cupboard we added baking powder, turmeric, everything bagel, my two extracts, and our mystery, hopefully, cocoa powder. Or like hot cocoa powder. So, I got those in there. And then in this cupboard, we've got, um, that's, I found my ranch, I knew I had one. Ranch and salts, and one pepper on this rack. Then we've got a, a jar of sugars and then like all of my oils on here. Vegetable oil here because it doesn't fit on here. Um, cocoa powder here. I in fact have five open packets of onion soup mix and some taco seasoning which I should probably make some tacos. That'd be yummy. And then I've got all of my powders up here. i um, got powdered sugar, brown sugar, flour, and sugar. I had a thing of breaded flour that I just went ahead and dumped in there. And then that's like um, my pile of like baked baking goods, uh, sprinkles, food coloring, candles, that kind of stuff in that bucket. But Jason's antsy, so we're gonna pause this video, pick up where I left off with my day with him. We're gonna go to Costco, so if you wanna see that, check out yesterday's video. And uh, yeah, so. Okay, we're back from Costco. I have a limited time. I've been put on a time frame to get my office drawer cleaned out. What are you talking about? It's clean. No, it's just declutter. It's just cluttered. So we're gonna, I don't know if I'm gonna empty everything out. Will you go and get me, just empty one of my little, the green um, storage containers that I have in my makeup drawer? Just get me one of them. I need to see if they're tall enough or too tall um, to fit in my drawer. Okay, so one thing I do know is that I need another little bin for these little clips. Um, and I think I have some empty ones somewhere. These ones all have stuff in them. Ashley takes them. She has stuff like that. She steals my things. So we're going to just start taking things out of the drawer. Those are probably, like, these are probably bad. We're just gonna start, let me see, Ash. Mm -mm. Well, here, no, got it. 
Okay, I'm gonna get another set of these at Target when I go. Here, go give those to Chelsea. Those are allergy meds. I'm gonna buy more at Target. That's oh, that's for my... Okay, well, we're still, we're taking things out. We're just taking things out. If it doesn't already have a little bucket... Ah, there's an empty one. See, Ash, I'm gonna give you that job. Put all of these guys in there. And have those go in there. There. I think you didn't use this because it doesn't fit. It doesn't need to have a lid on it. I just need it to go in there. Maybe not the biggest one. Try and get the little ones in there. We can clip these guys to the side, maybe. Okay, we're just gonna... See, I would like to not have like, all of these in here. Let's see what ones... We're just... This is where it's kind of cluttery. And if you don't just, like, pull the cord and, like... You just gotta do it. Just look at all these little discs. And then in here... Don't take the money. You'll take the money. I'll probably make that deal with you. There's stickers. What else is back here? Ooh, that's like a 50 cent piece. There's an empty. Nope. I don't even know what's in there. This? All right. Then what the heck is this? We have a bunch of cords. What the heck is this? That's a maybe even a silver dollar. Yeah, that is. That is a silver dollar. All right. Tape. That can get thrown away. Ew. Can you go get me the Clorox wipes, Ash? That's a Lego. I guess we could take that out. See There's what else another one. is missing underneath here. This is like more than I thought I was going to do. Oh, mystery things under here. Okay, we're just... I need that. Honestly, you guys, this is just the best way to do it. Because it forces you to... What the heck? This actually clean, clean things out. Yeah, because it probably got stuck under here. Oh, this is... It'll look good when we're done. I'm not going to do very much in this drawer because it doesn't really need it. But I am going to create a space for cords. I was looking for a specific cord. If you remember, I was trying to get my disc to work with my camera. So I pulled these guys out. And so I'm just gonna kind of create a little spot here for cords, but maybe I'll get them all with these little clippy things. I have a ton of these clips, so we're gonna do that. We're gonna we're gonna gather up all the cords. We're just gonna put them all in this space. All right, I just gotta. Oh, that's cute. I found that I don't like these because it's an actual sticker. The whole thing is a sticker, and it's not just this. Anyway, so I don't I don't use these as much. All right, now to get all of that back in the drawer, but I gotta sort through this. Ready, set. All right, just like that. I've got it all organized in this drawer. I've got some just random batteries. I'll probably put them back away another time, but I'm running out of time today. I have one puzzle piece that goes to the Christmas Advent puzzle. So I'm, <laughs> it's already packed away and all the Christmas stuff. So when we do that puzzle and there's one piece missing, actually I'm going to leave it like this, leave the lids, um, then I'll put that puzzle piece in. So these two I use often enough to leave the lids off. Then I've got all of these organized. I checked all the Sharpies. They all work. This is kind of like my tools, um, little teeny screwdriver, some white out band-aids that I have to hide so I have access to my own band-aids. Um, a little cord. I need to put the GoPro um, battery away. I don't know why that's not put away. And a little like dongle attachment and a block. And then I have a little bucket here with just my SD cards and flash drives. Um, I'll probably leave this here and get another set from Target because I was needing more for my drawer upstairs. Then I've got some stuff here. I'm probably just going to move this guy up here. I need to get some um, actual sticky notes that go the right way for this holder and then this is just kind of addresses for you guys. I'm actually going to I have Kaylee's thank you notes that she has written um, and I need to go through and get all the addresses and write those for those cards 
but all the addresses, but also all my little stickers for my pill cases are in here and little like instruction books that I keep on hand. I'm trying not to show the address on the front. <laughs> it's one of you guys. Um, the only things left here on the top, I'm probably going to, these are little shrinky dinks, the original shrinky dinks. These are from Jason's childhood, um, got it from his mom. So I'm probably gonna put those in a little container like this or maybe, I don't know, I wanna keep them close by. These cords, the little necklace um, that I wear, I'm just gonna tuck it in there. I don't have a place for this guy without it getting caught on the drawer. I guess I need to like, it doesn't fit, so I'm just gonna set it in there. So, those I need to find a little container for, like that. For now, they're just gonna go here. And then I've got all of these cords here that I'm going to put the little um, doodads on. Okay, I've got all of those. Um, maybe I'll rearrange. Oh, I can put these little blocks. Well, no, they work down here. Put my little, all my air tags are lined up. These little blocks here. One of these days, I will go through and check and see what each of these are. You can see some of them have labels. I just need to go through and see what they are and label them. That's just not gonna be today. But that looks way better than it did. And this is way better than it was. So I am gonna get another set of these so that I can actually have some structured, structured um, compartments over there. Um, but I do like how it came out. I have a pile of ponytails to put away, some sanitizer wipes. Probably just put that back in here for later. I forgot, where did the other tape go? Do you have the tape over there? See, tape could be another compartment. Tape could be a whole little long one. Yeah, I'm just gonna get another little set. Okay, I'm done. I don't, I'm gonna maybe, okay, we're just gonna, we're gonna let my phone charge. Really quick, if this video is not too long, which hopefully it's not, um, we will stay tuned and I will add in the new spice jars when I get them and show you what that cupboard looks like. But that's pretty good for right now. It's, it's manageable for right now. But I'm just going to, what is this? It's a chicken. Oh, it's the chicken. You guys are so funny. Can you put this in Chelsea's closet? Can you put the chicken harness? Here, I'm gonna give you a gift. No. This is, I don't need it in my junk drawer. Ash, could you go put it outside in the- All right, we're just, we're gonna be fast. Ash. We're gonna declutter this drawer because I said I was going to, but we're gonna go fast. Okay, this is all garbage. Actually, not the rule, ruler. Will it stick down? There we go, we'll get that out of the way. Okay, this is all garbage. This is what's staying in here. I wish this had a longer slot for it. But I do find I like to have one in here for candles. I'm gonna throw away these. Missed those. Wish there was, I wish this was a little bit wider. Oh, I put those in there. Okay, very basic. We don't even need an explanation. It's kind of junky. It is what it is, but it's done. And we take care of the mess immediately. They keep taking this card, this um, deck of mini cards isn't complete. So they keep using it to write notes for this is my food and that has peanut butter on it. That's fantastic. That is fantastic. So we are officially done. I forgot, I was editing and I forgot that I didn't show you the little bins that I got from uh, Target. Actually I need to put this battery in the actual battery case, but I don't wanna lose it, so I put it in here. We've got our tape, and yes, this might seem a little like ridiculous to do one container with just tape, but the amount of times this girl, oh, let's see, there's my scissors. She already tries to take stuff. She already tries to take, take my stuff. So I need to, to be like, hey, if I don't see tape in here, I'll be like, Ashley, where's my tape? She actually has a supply of her own stuff over there. Really quick, we've got um, all of my, well, I've got the little silver dollars. Oh so yeah, these are silver dollars. I've just got like sticky notepads in here. And then I've got those addresses in there. And then all of my SD cards. And then none of this was different. So, oh, I actually added chapsticks in here so they don't get lost. And yes, this drives me crazy to not pull it forward. One, it kind of slides back and forth. But also, when I try to open it, if that 
is right up next to this. I can't grab a hold right here. So I just have it, it's a little bit of, it kind of drives my OCD crazy <laughs> to not have it all the way to the edge or to line up with these guys, but I'd rather be able to open the drawer. So that's it. Okay, that's it for my decluttering era. <laughs> Ashley made fun of me. She's like, mom, that's kind of dorky, but it's fun. So I, if I get that spice rack soon, I'll add it into this video. Otherwise, stay tuned for another daily video and I'll give it a little reveal of it. I'll probably do both. I'll probably do both. Show you the reveal of a new spice cupboard, but we gotta go get a few more spices at Target. So that's in the other video that you hopefully have already watched. So take care. We'll see you guys next time.